Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me again, Zundari Lagito Malingi or just for me, teacher Zundari. A licensed professional teacher major in mathematics. Ako po ay gumagawa ng mga Tagalog math tutorial mula grade 7 hanggang grade 11. Ito po ay tulong at dedikasyon para sa mga pagulang, sa mga magtuturo at lalo-lalo na sa ating mga kabataan. Ayan, kung bago ka pa lang sa aking YouTube channel, don't forget to like and share and hit the notification bell para updated ka sa aking mga bagong video na ipapalabas. Stay tuned! Magandang araw, muli ako po si Teacher GM. Ngayong hapon, tatalkayan po natin nagmula sa operation of functions. At may apat na quantities po ito. Ang una ay addition of functions. Pangalawa, subtraction of functions. Pangatlo, multiplication of functions. Pangapat ay division of functions. But ngayong araw, tatalakayin natin ang addition at saka ang subtraction of functions. Without further ado, let's get started! So, ngayon, tatalakayin muna natin una ang addition of functions. So, the quantity of, ayan, the quantity of f plus g times x equals the f of x plus f of g. So, yan po ang ating formula sa addition of functions. So, for example, so meron tayong f of x equal yan, 2x squared plus 3 and tapos ang ating g of x yan, g of x equal 4x cubed plus 1. So, yan. Take note that in adding function, this just says that to find the sum of two functions, add them together. So, you add natin lahat. Tapos, you should simplify by finding like terms. So, ibig sabihin, is simplify natin by finding like terms. Same ng kanilang term. Okay. So, ngayon, isolve natin to. So, we have f of x equals 2x squared plus 3. And g of x, we have 4x cubed plus 1. So, una, ano ang dapat natin gawin? I-add natin all together. So, you should simplify by finding like terms. So, so ang pwede natin i-add ito ay ang 3 plus 1. And in combining like terms, so in combining like terms, Make sure that put in an descending order. Anong ibig sabihin ng descending order? From pataas, pababa. Okay? Ayan, pababa po tayo. So, ngayon, isolve na natin. Okay, add natin. So, f of g equal. So, 2x squared plus 3 plus 4x cubed plus 1. Okay, next, i-arrange natin into descending order. So, we have, laguna ang mataas. So, ibig sabihin, 4x cubed followed by 2x squared. And next is positive 3 plus 1. Next, what will you do? I-add natin yung like terms. We have 4x cubed plus 2x squared plus 3 plus 1, that is 4. Ang ating sagot ay 4x cubed plus 2x squared plus 4. Nakuha. Okay, another example. Okay, example number 2. Meron tayong f of x equals 5x cubed plus 2x plus 1. Ang ating g of x equals 4x squared plus 3x plus 2. So ngayon, ano ang dapat natin gawin? I-combine like terms. So we have f plus g ayan so 5x cube kasi i-arrange natin ito the same thing order from taas pababa so next is we have meron tayong 4x cube 
followed by 2x and we have 3x next we have plus 1 and we have plus 2 next combine natin so 5x cubed plus 4x squared combine natin yun same like term so 2x plus 3x that is 5x and we have 1 plus 2 that is 3 so ngayon ang ating sagot ay 5x cubed plus 4x squared plus 5x plus 3 nasundan Okay, last example for addition of function. Okay, in example number 3, f of x, ayan, meron tayong 4 over 2x squared minus 2x plus 2. Ang ating g of x equals 10 over 5x squared plus 3x plus 3. So, i-combine natin ang like terms. I-arrest natin into descending order. So, we have... Meron tayong 4 over 2x squared followed by plus kasi positive 10 over 5x squared. Next, what will you do? So we have negative 2x plus 3x plus 2 plus 3. Bakit negative 2x sir? Kasi ang ating given ay negative 2x. Next, what will you do? I-combine natin like terms. So we have I divide na natin. So, 4 divide 2, that is 2, ayan, 2x squared. Okay? Ayan, 2x squared plus, how about 10 over 5, that is 2x squared. Ayan. Negative 2x plus 3x, that is positive x. And, ian natin yung dalawa, 2 plus, pa, 2 plus 3 rather, that is 5. Is it the final answer? Hindi pa. So, ibig sabihin, meron pa tayong a combine like terms. So, we have 2x plus 2x squared, that is 4, again, 4x squared plus x plus 5. Nasundan. Nakuha. Do you have any question? Any more clarification about addition of function? So, Ano ang ating formula sa addition of function? So, we have f plus g quantity of x equals the quantity of f of x plus the quantity of f of g. Okay. Nagkaintindihan na tayo. Okay, let's proceed to subtraction of function. In subtraction of function, in subtraction of function, to find the difference between two functions, and then subtract the first from the second quotient. Make sure that distribute the negative sign to each term of the second function. Ibig sabihin, you distribute natin yung negative sign sa ating second function. And you should simplify by combining like terms. Okay, halimbawa. So we have f of x equal 2x squared plus 3 and I will uh, adding g of x equal 4 uh, yet yeah, 4x cubed plus 1 okay paano natin yan ano ang roll natin so i-combine natin yung negative sign to the second function bakit i-combine natin yung negative sign sir saan ba saan ba galing yung negative sign kasi ang ating function is subtraction so ibig sabihin ang ating ginagamit na operation ay minus so kaya we have f minus g equals 2x squared plus 3 Ayan, i-combine, distribute natin yung negative sign. So, ang positive 4x cubed magiging negative. Ayan, negative 4x cubed. Ang positive 1 magiging negative 1. Okay, nakuha. Next, what will you do? So, combine natin. So, i-arrange natin into descending order. So, unahin mo natin yung biggest terms. We have 4x cubed followed by 4x, positive 4x, negative. That is, negative 4x. 
followed by positive 2x squared. And, isubtract natin yung positive 3 minus 1, that is positive 2. So, ang ating sagot ay 4x, negative 4x cubed plus 2x squared plus 2. Ayan, ito po ang ating f minus g. So, yan po ang ating sagot. Naku nga. Okay, another example. So, another example. So, f of x, meron tayong 4x cubed plus 2x squared plus 2. Ang ating g of x, meron tayong 8 over 2x cubed plus 3x squared plus 3. So, una, a, arrange natin into descending order. Are you sure? So, i-distribute natin yung negative sign. Sa second function, so we have f minus g yan equal 4x cubed plus 2x squared plus 2 and ang ating minus. Ayan, ang ating operation is i-distribute natin sa ating second function. So negative, ayan, positive 8 over 2 magiging negative 8 over 2x cubed and ito magiging negative 3x squared ito magiging negative 3. Masundan. Okay, next. We have, yan. I-arrange natin ito, descending order. So, we have 4x cubed minus 8 over 2x cubed. Yan. Plus 2x squared minus 3x squared plus 2 minus 3. Okay. Next. I-combine natin yung like terms. So, i-divide muna natin muna. So, we have 4x cubed minus 8 mi divided to that is 4. So, negative 4x cubed. Ayan. Plus 2x cubed minus 3x cubed plus 2 minus 3. Next, combine natin yung like terms. We have 4x cubed minus 4x cubed, that is 0. So, ibig sabihin, hindi na natin ilagay yan. So, 2x cubed, 2x squared rather, minus 3x squared, that is negative x squared. Positive 2 minus 3, that is what? Negative 1. So, ang ating sagot ay x squared minus 1. Masundan. Okay, do you have any question? Any more clarification? And that's all for today. At sana meron kayo napapulot na araw sa ating tutorial ngayong hapon. Hanggang sa susunod na higayon. See you to my next vlog. Bye bye. I'm back. Ayan. Kung nakatulong po sa inyo, please like this video at mag-comment na rin kayo sa baba. It's me again, Teacher GM. Lagi nagsasabi, stay safe, stay home, stay healthy, at mag-aral na mabuti para sa may magandang kinabukasan. See you to my next vlog. God bless and goodbye.